Hello and welcome to Benocam. Today we're going to be having a look at the mine workings around Unity Wood. This area has been mined for tin since the early 1780s and there is still evidence all around from the shallow open workings to deeper mine shafts. Tin was brought to the surface here in the form of cassarite and this area once contained many buildings and engines for pumping water, hauling materials and processing the ore, many of which are now long gone. Mining was finally abandoned here in the 1920s and the site was landscaped and made safe and then left grow over with the vegetation which now hides many of the mine features. Walking through the woods many trails you will see several well secured mine shaft openings. Although interesting to look down none of these access any workings anymore as they have all been backfilled or even collapsed further down. There is still one small mine shaft hidden well away from the public paths which still allows us to go and have a look at some of these old underground stopes where Tim was once located. Very professional. So we're gonna have a little look down this small one today. See what's at the bottom. Leads to some interesting little small pokey workings. Got Griff with me today. He's very excited about it. And we've got Vinzo who's gonna be at the top looking after our ropes for us. Top watch. <laughs> where we're going. That's how it's done. <laughs> <laughs> and he's away. Hang on. It's cosy. Oh, they've chucked a load of branches down, are they? Yeah, it's fucking loaded. Ah. So, unfortunately, someone's thrown a load of stuff down this mine shaft. There's loads of branches and loads of bits of wood which have been lobbed down. So, Griff's down there at the moment clearing them all. Hopefully, he's going to manage to clear the passage through. We all check back up on him. There's not much room to put it when you move it. You know? <laughs> Might be a little bit of an exercise. So he's down there now, he's going to stack all the stuff to one side and it sounds like we're still going to be able to access the workings which is good. And we're now going to go down. This is probably one of the smallest shafts I think we've been down. This one is tiny. So that's where we're going. And we can see the bottom here. <laughs> Where we fit. Oh. And we're in. <laughs> oh, hey Griff. Hello. So this is all the stuff which Griff's been down here hauling into the shaft. <laughs> all these fucking big bits of wood here. Yeah. <laughs> That's, a, blocks, that's blocks, a lot of gear. All sorts of stuff in the so way. So someone's done their best to keep us out of here, which is a bit of a shame. So where we're going is just right down in there, and you can see the remains of the ladder down there now. That's where we're headed. So we're in a bit of a stoke now, you can see Griff down the bottom. And you can look right up. It's not very wide. It's not very wide. They've done a good job of chasing the stuff out, haven't they? Yeah, that's where we've got to go. Down there? Yeah, down in front of you. See where someone's chased something there, for sure. Now they've got an old bucket here. That's pretty cool. Left behind when the mine shut. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. There's not a lot left of that, is there? She's solid though. Yeah, some of it's falling in here. Holding up a load of stone. Yeah, 
yeah. careful not to touch the ceiling here. Oh yeah. Looks pretty unstable. Get through this section. Oh yeah, look at that. Someone's reused an old old military ammunition box, probably as an explosive box or something like that. Unless it was their lunch box, it was a big a lunch fine, box, or a fine crib box. <laughs> <laughs> Narrow bit and then it goes into the crawl and then into the bigger stoke, doesn't it? Some lovely timbers there behind you all. I know, it looks fucking terrifying. <laughs> 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 looks like the ground's gonna suddenly swallow you up. Let's do it. <laughs> Is it narrow enough, Danny? Yeah. It's pretty tight. It gets a bit bigger here, though. That's good. Not much. Well, we'll settle for a bit bigger. Carefully does it. We're in a bit bigger tunnel now, which is good. It's now getting a little bit more headroom for walking. A few rocks stacked up. Uh, and another drill steel and another real narrow bit by the look of it. <laughs> It just goes up and up from here. And down. Up and down. Getting a bit narrow down there. Yeah. So the miners in this area, they really did just take up, take out just enough of what they really wanted here. This, this stope is so narrow, it's literally shoulder to shoulder width. And it just goes to show that it's a lot of hard work to get this material out, so they they really did just remove what they needed to. So we'll show you where the stoke goes now. It goes down this lovely metal ladder, which you can see disappearing down there into the distance. It is a galvanized ladder, it's just good. Okay, so we've made it to the bottom of the ladder. As you can see, she's a bit worse for wear. The old rungs just broke on me. And that's where we've come from up there. You can see Griff up there. <laughs> and then it just, uh, I'm here stood on a bit of a plank. And it just keeps going down and down. Squeeze down through now. Just have a little quick look at the bottom. So when I say about how narrow it is, this is how narrow it is. <laughs> that's one shoulder, and that's the other shoulder. <laughs> it's really, really narrow. So there's some good examples right here of what, what they were after in this mine. There's just here in the, in the tunnel floor, we've been finding these bits and pieces. That black sparkly stuff, that is what it's all about. That is your tin ore. It's usually in these, with these quartz veins as well. That's quite a common feature, but quite a piece, few pieces left here, which is unusual. You'd think they would have had that out, but little bit they missed. But an interesting little mine. Yeah, I do. Should we yeah. go home? Yeah, go for it. And there's our lovely dodgy ladder. You see how tight that is now? Yeah, that's really tight. Don't look at it. Huh? Don't look at it. <laughs> yeah, true. If you don't see it, it doesn't exist. If you don't mind, it doesn't matter. Yeah, true. Oh my God, I'm so stuck. Oh. Okay, we are up from those dodgy ladders now. I'm not gonna lie, that's that's pretty that's pretty sketchy down there. Those ladders are of very questionable strength. I don't think it's a very good idea to 
trust them again. But yeah, time to make our way back to the entry shaft. Okay, that is Unity Wood done. Pretty much everything you can get in here. As always, I would definitely recommend not going in any of these yourself. It's pretty dangerous. That's why we make these videos so that you can see what's down there without putting yourself in harm's way like we do. Um, hope you've enjoyed the video. We'll get some more put together for you soon. <laughs>